Sure. Take off the upkeep stops for now because I don't need them yet. <clears throat> Oh jeez, what's happening over there? Basic Island Pass. Um, let's go squawk. Be hilarious if this gets spell snared. Always yield. Yes. Grab the other two. I'd really like to draw another planes here. That'd be nice. I think I'm just going to try and martyr here. Counter target spell must control pace 2 plus a... Okay, so the world's worst mana leak. Sure. No. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> I don't know what's happening right now. Land? path. Do I really just ghost quarter my own flagstones? I mean, it's not really going to go into much use anywhere else. <sighs> yeah. Ghost quarter myself. Clearly I do, yeah. That's that's what it is. Just not drawing any lands or anything. It's miserable. Play another squawk. That one resolves. No rune snags. <laughs> Combat and attack. The world's worst beatdowns. One one squadron hawks. Think twice, okay. And opt. Yep. I have no idea what's going on. Why are you playing Rune Snag? Just like <laughs> Okay. Uh Dynavolt Tower in modern. I don't know what I'm playing against. <laughs> okay, cool. So I do draw another land. Hey Idol, how's it going? No. I don't know. Dynavolt Tower and Modern. I I have no idea what's happening. They played a rune snag earlier, which so I I I, I don't know what ha is happening.
Probably connection issues. Heidel. Is stream frozen frozen for anybody else? Well, clearly Heidel just sucks then. He's probably watching from his phone anyway. <laughs> I mean, I don't I know I don't have the greatest I don't have the greatest of connections here, so it's probably not going to be the greatest quality regardless, but I figured why not. <laughs> sure. It's going to boomerang some lands. What the hell is going on? <laughs> is this like a mono blue Aetherworks Marvel deck? Or is like, are we just going the Dynavolt Tower plan? Because I've never seen this deck before in my life. Okay, kills the Wayfarer. Uh, Misfell Plains, Sarah Ascendant. These Pass and Day of Judgments are just amazing right now. Oh, he is actually playing Mana Leak. <laughs> cool. Yep. Just continue beating down with the squad. <laughs> oh my god, what is happening? Okay, still doing nothing. Is there only Wincon Dynavolt Tower? <laughs> That's right, we got squad goals going on right now. Try another Sarah Ascendant, I guess. Rewind. Cool. <laughs> oh, hey, Zach, what's up? Are you going to shoot down a Squadron Hawk here? If he shoots it down, I'm probably just going to path it just so I can get another land. Yeah. I'm just going to path it so I can get this Ranger online. I, I don't either, Zach. I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> Opponents to six. Got you on a turn turn two turn clock. <laughs> sure. I'm still waiting to see how I die. That that's the real question here. I imagine it's some type of turns something. I don't know. Okay, now they're on a three turn clock. This ranger's going to come down. And this is going to start getting me some value, though. Or...
Oh yeah, that, I I just I have to scoop immediately. I, I I can't do anything. I'm just gonna proc back these three guys. I don't know who Fading Apple is. Mono Blue Teachings. So they're going to search for a counter spell, and I'm going to continue beating down with Squatcher Nox. Yep, Mystical Teachings for Rewind. Sure. Rewind happens. Yep. Okay. Did they not even untap their lands with this rewind? <laughs> Might as well play this Kami. I mean, while well, they're tapped out when they shouldn't be. Okay. Kills a squawk. Sure. My entire squad is almost dead, but we're getting there. Yeah, Ghostly Prison's going to do a lot. Uh, let's go attacking. I imagine we just try to ranger here. I mean, there's no reason not to. Sure. Here comes, like, boomerang and snap and... <laughs> Ranger. Are you going to untap your lance this time? Probably not. Nope. <laughs> they still don't untap their lands. What is this thing? It takes like five? Yeah, it takes five. Okay. Mystical teachings to turn on Dynavolt Tower. I mean, they're not dead, technically. <laughs> Teferi? What? Sure. Yeah, I think it's just your connection, Heidel. Uh, neither of them are having problems. So. Okay, so they can flash into Fairy, but he doesn't have flying, so. Can still get in for one. <laughs> sure. I'm guessing mono blue to fairy. I <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what this is. <laughs> Aether eyes. What? Hi, Idol. Glad you can join us.
They're up to 11 lands. And they're still doing absolutely nothing. The only other card in their hand right now is Teferi. So we just Squadron Hawk. Sure, flash into Fairy, that's fine. No path that's a fairy while you have no cards in hand. I mean, yeah, I, I guess it's a deck, but like, I have no idea how it wins besides Dynavolt Tower. So, yeah, I have no idea. <laughs> Opponent's dead in two turns. <laughs> Ranger. Good lord. I should have attacked first so I could prevent the energy from being got. Oh well, Squadron Hawk is dead. Ranger of Eos is getting countered, and I have about a million turns. I mean, that's true, Zach. <laughs> counter unless I pay four. This is just my graveyard, right? Yeah. Now I will not pay four for Rune Snag. And now Squadron Hawk is going to die. Should have attacked first to put him to one, but oh well. I'm a bad player. Yeah, that's true. Ameria becoming active is going to be very good for me. That's three planes away. Probably just going to Ghost Quarter. Well, all of these are planes, so I guess the only thing I would Ghost Quarter is another Ameria, and I really would like to turn both of these on if I could. I mean, it's another plane, so we're getting there. For Glimmer of Genius, gets them more energy so they can start shooting other things down. Have they finally slowed us down enough to the point where Dynavolt Tower could actually kill us? <laughs> I mean, every spell they cast is four energy. Right now they have nine nine damage that they can deal 
going to deal damage now. Oh, jeez. Yeah, if only I had Grishel Brand to play. I, I would love to play the meme right now. Someone donate me the entire list of Grishel Brand, and I will play it and be terrible with it. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Opponent's going all in. Do we ghost quarter in Ameria for another planes? We'll see. Uh, flagstones. That can get us our two planes to get there. Boom. <laughs> so, right now they have six damage they can deal. Can I actually pay six? No. <laughs> oh, this is silly. I don't know what the hell's going on anymore. <laughs> Are we actually going to lose to this? I mean, I don't know if the deck is bannable. I, I, I really don't think it's bannable, but it's fun. Yeah, to be fair, I shouldn't have Day of Judgmented. If they had a counter spell, then they get eight energy. Yeah, that it, it was a bad play, for sure. Okay. So we are going to ghost quarter our flagstones to get a couple planes. I mean, if something were to be banned, it would be the Mana Monkey, but I don't know. It just depends on how good Shoal becomes. I mean, it's top eight in some events and stuff, but if it starts like, if it starts being super consistent, then I could see it being banned. But right now, it's okay. So Mary is online. I'm going to get Ranger and Ranger. Yes. Yes. Martyr, Ascendant. Yes, Martyr, Ascendant. So Martyr. Sack Martyr, reveal all these. Martyr, Sack Martyr, reveal both of these. Um, we'll go ahead and play both of these, because I don't care if they die, because I have a Maria online now. And we'll just pass from there, see what happens.
and get back squadron hawk get back squadron hawk there we go <laughs> jesus that was so long uh avon mind sensor seems okay for mystical teachings um i don't think i need any of these day of judgments uh disenchant's fine Oh, okay. I guess the opponent doesn't want to play the match anymore. And that's what happens when you go into tournament practice, though. If I were actually running this through a league, that'd be a little bit better. But I don't really want to pay $8 to just play a league when I'm probably not going to cash anyway. I would have considered bringing in. I would have considered bringing in Mana Tithe. Okay, so both of our lands come in tapped, but we do have a Wayfarer. Uh, we're on the play. We'll keep this. Hopefully, we're not. Hopefully we're not up against, like, Grishel Brand or something that can just kill us on turn one out of nowhere. It's a mountain. Oh, no. Misville Plains Wayfarer? I'd rather Wayfarer die than anything else if the opponent decides to bolt. Looks like they're going to. Yep. Oh, okay. Oh. That's not good. I don't like having a Maria shut off. <laughs> I don't think the double white is going to come into effect at any point, but I don't like a Maria being turned off. Um... Do I even run out of Sarah Ascendant here? No, yeah. I mean, I might as well. If they kill it, then they kill it. I always have Ranger to go get me some more. And depending on if this is control or not, I might path my own Sarah Ascendant to get the land for Ranger for sure. All right, later, Zach. Thanks for hanging out, buddy. Molten Brain. <laughs> oh. Uh, I mean, I guess I float a white. Is this like, is that land destruction? I think the opponent should definitely kill my flagstones. That's got to be the best target, right? I don't think there's any reason to play a ghostly prison, especially if they're on a land destruction plan. This might be a breach deck, now that I think about it. Oh. Mm, okay. Okay. Sure, Sahili Rai. And we draw a Day of Judgments. I mean, we might as well play a Ghostly Prison, because if their plan is to cat us, then that kind of shuts that plan down. Do we, do we care about Sahili? Not enough to throw one damage at it. It's fine. <laughs> Okay. 
I'm just going to auto yield to that. There's no reason. I don't have any I don't have any ways to respond or anything, but Ugh. opponent with the spreading seas. I don't know why they didn't go with flagstones. I mean, I guess it doesn't really matter, but. Okay, there's a planes. We're going to attempt Ranger of Eos here. It's probably going to get countered. Oh, it resolves. Okay. Well, that's good for us. Uh, yes. Sarah Ascendant and Martyr of Sands. Okay. Still, I have no idea what the opponent's on. I probably bring in Avon Mind Sensor over the Day of Judgments. What is this red or black? Yeah, Celestial Purge might not be bad either. Um, take out a path for it. Yeah, this is fine. Uh, this hand's fine. I will keep this. Wayfarer. Relic doesn't bother me too much here. Because I can win without Proclamation of Rebirth. Like, that's a thing. I don't really care about Relic. Cracks it now. Okay. <laughs> Let's get the squad online. Yes. Squawk and squawk. I want to build this deck in paper so bad. This deck's just a ton of fun to play. Stone, right? Okay. Well, Sun Titan will eventually be good. If we ever get there with their land destruction spells. Hmm. Yeah, I need to have my white sources. Draw another white source, that's good. Play another squawk. Sure. Mog War Marshal. I mean, I guess they get more tokens.
All right, so we're just gonna purge the Sahili Rai and drop a Saras in it. Snap for Stone Rain, I guess. Yeah. I mean, we're never going to get the Sun Titan. We run 24 lands in this deck, and we already have four in the graveyard, so yeah. I mean, Flagstones is good. We will Squadron Hawk. Opponent is already empty handed. Well, except for the card they drew for turn, but. It's fine, we'll take some damage. There's another planes. I mean, we're drawing our lands for sure, but. Get in. Should have cast the other squawk. Oh well. This is another stone rain. Jesus. Uh fine. Opponents on mono land destruction and mark mog war marshals. I mean, <laughs> I'm not going to complain when I just keep on getting lands. Play the squawk that I should have played last turn. No, don't want to search. Flagstones. Keep the untapped. Yes. Get a misfail planes. And go attacking. Idol, are you going to be at Modern tomorrow? Oh my god. Sure. <laughs> this is ridiculous. There are seven lands in the graveyard. Seven. Sure. Block and sack, revealing proclamation of rebirth and sun titan. Cool. 
I guess me gaining six life is enough to make the opponent scoop. Okay. Um, let me see here. Let's see. I think I have it pretty much set up now. Sideboard's a little different, but this is basically what I'm going to be running tomorrow. Not going to be playing Flagstones. I'm not going to be playing Tech Edge, but yeah, this is pretty much what I'm playing tomorrow. Let's test this out. Don't want to play against Mono Land Destruction again. Um, yeah, it's a little land heavy, but that's fine. I only run 20 lands in this version anyway. Uh, guess they go flagstones. I mean, there's no reason not to. Oh, this is Delver. Little land heavy, I say, as we draw nothing but lands. Okay, so this is definitely blue black Delver. Let's see if they flip it. And of course they do. I swear, I am the unluckiest with this. Every time that I play Delver, it doesn't flip. But every time an opponent plays Delver, it flips every time. Every time. <laughs> Planes. Planes. They did draw. Okay. Let's think about this. They did draw a mana leak. Just going to play another squawk here. Sure. Use the mana leak on the squawk. I don't care. I'd rather resolve Spectral Procession or Honor of the Pier. So Grixis Delver. Procession. Probably have the counter for this too. Of course it's mana leak. Mm. We'll play an ascendant here. Bolts the squawk, and we're dead. Hits us a 10. Stops on our draw step, probably is going to click us. Oh, God. <laughs> what do you want? Okay, gives us Martyr of Sands. I mean, I guess we play it. <laughs> Nothing else to do besides die to being flooded. Well, opponent just has nuts. Yep. You hit us to four. It's a ghost quarter. Oh 
Oh my god. Honor. Should have sacked. Yeah, we're just dead. We're just dead. So, what's good in this matchup? Crypt. Crypt is fine. Let's go down a couple pride mates. Pride mates aren't great in this matchup. I just have to grind it out with life. That's probably it. Serum Visions, bottom top, we do get to resolve a Squadron Hawk here, that's cool. Go get the other two. Come on, opponent, tap out. You know you want to. So they could have spell pierce. Other than that, I think it resolved this procession. Do have to pay a life for it, but that's fine. And they have the pierce. Oh, okay. Thought scour. I thought they had the pierce. That was going to be super tilting. <laughs> uh, attack with the squawk. Now my best draw is just honor of the pure. Fatal push on top. Fatal push drawn for turn, not on top. I guess we just attempt to path this. Well, let's go. Gets a mountain, I assume. Yep. And we'll go ahead and play another squawk. Okay. Well, nothing's dying, so that's cool. Put it ups. We don't have any responses. I mean, I guess we should feign a path to exile, but I just, I don't think it matters. Dang. 
Buckler. Good thing all of our shit flies. Drop a ranger. I'm assuming we get double martyr. Yeah, if we can get double martyr. Double martyr seems better. Play a martyr. I guess we'll have it pushed. Didn't even think of that. Yep. Well, that was a misplay. Oh well. I think we're still pretty in control of this game. Unless opponent finds second red source anger. Sure, hit us for five. That's fine. I'm not gonna block. Another chef at dunes. Does that mean they're just dead? Uh, sacrifice that. See how opponent responds. Because even if they kill Ranger, they kill Squawk, do they revolt a push on Ranger? Because that'll kill him. This right here kills him. I guess they can flash and snap, push a Spirit. Yeah. Do they push a spirit or do they push ranger? They push a spirit. They block ranger. They go to four. Okay. I think we just go for the same thing next turn. Try to close out this game. Okay. Yep, I do not have the path opponent. Do your worst. Passes. Or I could get another ranger. Uh, let's try to resolve another ranger. I don't think it's worth it to try and win here because I could just die on the backswing to like swing bolt snap bolt. Mana leak. Sure. Um, I'm just going to attempt to gain some life here and swing. Okay, snap. Comes in for push, which pushes a spirit. So we would not have just won. Okay, I guess they don't push a spirit, but they are dead next turn if they don't draw anything. Sure.
Do we take the five? Because they could kill a spirit and survive for another turn, but this way... I think we take the five. If something horrific happens, we can sack it. And go back up to ten. Yeah, this is fine. Thought Scour. Sure. Mills a bolt and a thought scour. Ooh, crypt is a draw. Crypt is a draw. Nuke your grave, no Snapcaster shenanigans. Get in there? Come on, you know you want to die, opponent. You've just been waiting to die. Yes! Okay, good. Good, good, good. Uh, we are on the draw. I think we bring in Mana Tithes. We'll take out an Honor... Take out a procession. Take out a path. This hand's gas. This hand's good. Thought seize Inquisition. What you got? Just Delver. Okay. Uh, we will play a Souls Attendant. Does your Delver flip? Verdict says no. Cool. We'll go ahead and play a Flagstones. Play, or attempt to play a Martyr of Sands. Okay. Martyr of Sands gets countered, then I'll just path their Delver. Yeah, we're going to path their Delver. I will not pay three, and I will attack for one. Because we have proc, and if that resolves, that's good. Okay. Tech Edge. Attempt to resolve another sister. Always yes, always yield. I think we leave up Tech Edge here. There's no reason for me to get down on honor right now. I'm gonna kill watery grave. 
opponents officially. Well, they were officially off of black mana. Attempt to resolve a Sarah Ascendant. Sarah Ascendant resolves. I guess we'll go ahead and try and play in honor of the pier. Cracks. Gets a black source, pushes Sarah, send it. Our lives are sad. Unless they tap out and we can Proclamation of Rebirth. Then that's going to be sweet. But, oh, it's just a snap for Mana Leak. Okay. Okay. Sure. And they bolt the Sarah Ascendants. It's kind of tilting, but yeah. I mean, yeah, we just we we just have to go for it here. Attendant, attendant. Ascendant. I doubt this resolves, but okay. I guess it resolves. I guess they either have an anger or a lot of kill spells. Always yes. Always yes. I mean, I'm sure they have an anger here, but... Sure. Crypt. Opponent thought long and hard about that crypt. We just need to draw another land and attempt to resolve this Ranger of Eos. There's an Angler. Guess I should have cryptid. Oh, well. Yep. Run this ranger to the counter spell, which I'm sure is the last card in their hand. Oh, cool. It resolves. Um... What do we go get? Probably double ascendant. The question is, is if is the opponent running any more basics or can I just start strip mining them? I could just start attempting to strip mine. 
Sure, get him for five. That's fine. All right, let's do the test. If they don't grab a basic here, I'm just going to start killing their black sources. They grab a basic. Uh, it's to run out of Saris, isn't it? It resolves. I don't want to start strip mining yet, though, because, like, I don't know. If I draw another ranger, I want to attempt to resolve it, but, like... Well, I mean, it's another ranger. I'm going to attempt to resolve said ranger. Okay. Ranger will get me Ascendant Murder of Sands. Now they're just going to be dead in multiple ways. Uh, nuke the graves now. So they can't recast Anger of the Gods. Okay, they do have double Snapcaster. That is unfortunate. So they're waiting up to double Snapcaster. I mean, yeah, we nuke the graves. And now they can't cast it? Yep. <laughs> GG, opponent. Alright. Yeah, I think I'm going to call it here. Because I'm not sure if anybody else is watching at the moment. And I kind of want to check out the video for the stream, make sure everything ran okay. But um, if anybody's here still, thank you for hanging out. I plan to try to make this a regular thing. Um, cause I have the space to do it now and I like streaming. I think it's a lot of fun. So hopefully this gets a little bit more popular and I can just hang out with you guys, but all right until then I'll see you next time.